Hey there guys, it's Long Couch, and it is that time again. Welcome back to Zelda. We're here at the statue of the 8th heroine. What do you guys say we keep this train rolling, as we have been doing? But of course, it's been more than 24 hours, so... Let's see if we get lucky today. I'm not holding my breath. But you never know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you know what? Okay, I might be the biggest dumbass in the world, but I honestly need to come in and check this at this point. It's been so long we've been trying to get this goddamn tunic. Is it the kind of thing where, like, I already have it and I didn't even freaking realize it because I'm just that dumb? Here's all our tunics, right? Actually, okay, let's sort by type. And then we're looking for the wind stuff. Which is... Right here. We've got the cap of the wind and the trousers of the wind. Yeah, we don't have the tunic of the wind, guys. We still don't have it. And apparently we are never going to. <laughs> I honestly just had to check that. Because at this point I was like, am I ever going to get this thing? The answer is no. But anyways, here's Ganondorf too. What you got for me, big guy? Hey, decent claymore. Well, let's just see what we can part with. Uh, we've got a level 20 Frostblade. Level 20. Yeah, that's what it is. It's a level 20 Frostblade, guys. I don't actually have any royal broadswords right now. I should probably use up one of these and make room for that. I think this frost blade is actually the crappiest thing I have right now. So I'm just gonna do this real quick. And then be gone with it. Which may be a poor tactical choice, seeing as how we're technically supposed to be in the desert right now. <laughs> we're just caught up doing things here. That's okay though, we'll be alright. Alright guys, so we kind of got the main purpose out of the way, the main purpose of us coming here. But there is more to do in the immediate... Why can't I not hook my parasail right here? Ah, there we go. Uh, in the immediate moment, we need to come back in this direction and we need to go hit that shrine that I marked. Oh look, I didn't even know I'd be able to stand right here, that's actually quite handy. Rivali's Gale is now ready. Hey, look at that timing, awesome. I don't really need my super jump right now, but it's nice to have it back. But yeah, all shrines must be completed. If not immediately, then very quickly after discovery, guys. That's the rule, you guys know it, we gotta stick to it. After we do that, I'm actually not entirely sure what I want to do. I kind of want to keep exploring this area more, but I also kind of want to go back to the desert. I don't know. I'm being pulled in a couple different directions, guys. I am also going to take out all these guys if I can pull something sneaky here. I'd like to bring them all right here in the middle. Okay. <laughs> okay. Get up. Get up, Link. Get up. Oh, oh. Well, I took a beating doing it, guys, but I did manage to kill them all with one bomb. <laughs> which was my primary goal right there. And it didn't really, like, save me anything or accomplish anything other than scoring me a couple cool points. Which I'm okay with. What's up, Mr. Butterfly? Get in my pockets. Ah, I love this game. Okay. There it is. Well, Zalfo is waiting for us over there. He can wait. Oh! Attack up plus nine. Not bad. Not bad. You know, I think I will just replace the one we're currently carrying after I use it to murder this guy. <laughs> and this wolf. Oh! Oh, that's gotta hurt. That's gotta hurt so bad. That dude's a trooper though. Look at him. He's still on fire. And he's just like, I'm out of here. Fuck this. <laughs> okay. I was going to take his meat, but you know what? He earned that survival right there. I'll let him go. I'll let him go do his thing. <laughs> so long, Meteor Rod. You're being replaced with a better one. But don't take it personal. You served me well for the little time that I carried you. Alright, let's go back to this. And we're heading for the green pin right now, guys. I guess I might as well kill this outpost while I'm here, too. Because it probably has a chest with a weapon that I don't need. But, I've gotta know. I have to know, guys. Ooh, shrine nearby? That's probably picking up the one that I am heading towards. Damn, that was three arrows. Let's see if the meat freezes here. 
Maybe it didn't freeze because I have a flame blade equipped and I was standing next to it last time? I don't remember if I was actually that close to it. No, it's just not cold enough. It's cold enough in certain spots and not cold enough in certain other spots in this region. Very interesting. Oh, I hate that beeping. I'm gonna leave it on, though. I'm gonna do it. Is there really nobody guarding this chest? Is it a real chest? It is. There's gotta be, like... Well, I was gonna say there's gotta be, like, some... Some stalls that would pop up and guard it, but it's the middle of the freaking day. They can't do that. Something over there, too. Alright. Let's try this. Ah! There they are! <laughs> I wasn't expecting shoes. I was expecting something. E. Careful now. Careful. These dudes can do some damage. Yep. Yeah. Okay. That is actually quite dangerous. I'm gonna back up and do this. Punch up. Punch up right there. Come on. Come on. Oh, how'd I miss both of them? Jesus. I was like, maybe I'll be cool and I'll get both of them. Negative. I'm gonna try not to heal until I get to that shrine, guys, because if I can complete the shrine, I'll get a full heal out of that. And if I fail, I've got Mifa's Grace backing me up, so... It's all good. Oh, yay, rupees. Love it. So wait, what's this thing over here? It's probably... I'm gonna guess an air current. That's what I'm putting my money on, guys. Fuck you. Nice try. Nice try. Go tell all your friends in hell that Long Couch killed you for acting the fool. Okay. Well, this whole thing is already surrounded by a giant air current, so... Look at that dude over there. Wow, he's got some peepers, man. He saw me from way far back. Nice. So, why do I want this thing? Hey! Calm down! I'm looking around at things. That would be the Korok that I already got up there. So I don't need that. Wait, is it? Yeah, because I had to come down here and get the block. And then I went back up there. Yeah. Okay. I'm confusing myself, guys. This game is too damn big. Alright, let's just keep flying this direction. Right over there is the shrine. Yeah, I was going to say, how did I see the shrine from there? But I saw it from the next level up, where the actual blocks were. Okay. That's actually what was throwing me off. It wasn't that I didn't recognize the area. I didn't recognize how I spotted the shrine from that position. <laughs> but it was the wrong position. Makes sense. Kema Kosasa Shrine. Okay. Couldn't help but notice that God threw a couple giant snowballs at me there, but his aim was pretty bad, so fuck him. Oh, it's a major test. It had to be a major test. <laughs> it just had to be, guys. Well, trying to do this with only two and three quarters hearts is probably a recipe for disaster, so we should probably just go ahead and we don't really need a buff. We just need a little bit of heal. Fruitcake. That'll probably be enough to get me through if I swap to... I have too many clothes now, guys. I never know where anything is. Here we go. This stuff. Nope. <laughs> that stuff. And a Guardian Sword Plus Plus. Perfect. Let's do this. Oh, let's get Cryonis queued up too, because... Well, actually, that didn't work to block the attacks last time, but I don't know. Maybe I'll try again. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Aha, I was ready that time. Kill this guy as quickly as possible. No dicking around. Stop blocking everything, fucker. He's not even facing me right now. Okay, uh, this, this is pissing me off. <laughs> oh, 
I don't know if that was worth a charge, but I figured I'd do it anyway. Okay. Oh, here we go. Here it comes. This isn't going to work, but I'm going to try. Yep, he goes right through it. How the fuck are we supposed to actually block that in here, then? Thank you, Hylian Shield. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, the laser. Okay. Okay. How about this, you some bitch? Eat multiple arrows right to your eyeball. Damn. We just did a crap load of damage with that, guys. That was awesome. Okay, we've almost got this dude. Let's just wipe him out with this. Yeah. So I didn't keep track there, guys, but the ironic thing is I actually might have gotten through that with just the hearts I had. <laughs> I'm actually not sure, but I think I did pretty good. Okay, so what do I have? A spear plus plus with durability and another spear plus plus with attack up. Mm, I'm actually okay with that. I'm just going to hang on to those and leave the other ones behind. I like the spears, guys. I don't get to use them enough. Okay. Now, what do we want out of this? We want either a gold rupee or a diamonds. One of those two. Come on, give it to me. Alright, silver rupee. That was the runner-up. Sure, I can live with that. <laughs> and I think this is going to be number five for us? Yeah, nice. Right. Okay, let's suit back up with climate-appropriate gear. I'm not kidding, guys. Is for, Like, from here on out, it's going to take me forever to find the clothes I want. <laughs> uh, it doesn't sort the snow boots in with the other cold-resistant stuff. That has its own category, I suppose. Where does it... Put? Ah, there they are. Yeah, it's got, like, little, little boot prints right there. Check that out. <laughs> Uh, oh yeah, I also remembered off-camera that the reason some of those other dragon parts exist is actually because we need some to upgrade our snow quill, not our snow quill, our uh, champion tunic. And I don't remember which parts it needs, so I may actually end up, um, I may end up going to check that out uh, sooner rather than later, just to refresh myself. We may have the parts we need already, actually, that would be really nice. But on top of that, I just want to check to see if... We can upgrade these snow boots at all, because that would actually be uh, really nice if we could do that. So, yeah, okay. Mark that chest. Now, at this point, guys, let's check out our hero's path mode. And we can see we've covered a fair amount of this area, but there's still a lot left. I think I'm going to at least climb Mount Agat over here. I kind of want to do like a circuit all the way around here. And just look for a couple more shrines or whatever else fun we can find. We may end up having to come back to this area later to, like, fully finish it off. I don't think we're going to cover, like, 100% of it right now. But I do want to do, like, a little bit more before we head back out. I also want to kill these guys. Because they annoy me. With their constant howling. I do wish maybe, like, there was a little bit more variety in the way some of those encounters played out when you're out in the wild. Because 100% of the time, when you get close to a wolf, it's going to look and see you, and it's going to howl, and then it's going to charge. And then you're going to kill one of them, and then the rest are going to run away. It gets very, very predictable after a while. <laughs> yeah, get back here. I want to know how long these guys can stay on fire. Oh, he didn't stay on very long. Okay. Oh, shit. Flame blade's not going to work on these bros. Although, I think the ice blade would. They're fire type, right? Ah. 
No! Okay. That's fine. We gotta use up some of these boomerangs. This is actually an excellent item to use against these guys, because it's quick. Hmm. So I'm gonna catch at least one of them with that. <laughs> Alright, you fucking monkey. Stand still long enough for me to do that to you. That guy's gonna have to wait. I can't believe this dude's still frozen. Look at him. Oh, nice try. Ah, he got frozen by his buddy. What an idiot. Okay, now as for you, you will get flame sorted. Look at this Octorok just show up out of nowhere. <laughs> just like, hey guys, I can fight too. Opportunist bastard. He got what he deserved. Okay. Very good. Kind of surprised at the amount of enemies I'm finding around here, honestly. Ah! Okay, so, hold up. What kind are these dudes? Because I thought they were, like, fire-type, but there's something else altogether. Oh, they're just black. They look red to me. <laughs> uh, it's alright, though. Oh, shit! Ooh! Okay. It's like that, huh? Knock these dudes off their perch. Ugh! <laughs> nice try, motherfucker. It's too quick for you. Yeah, my life. Yeah, I kind of knew as I was throwing that 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 was a terrible idea. <laughs> but for some reason, I just still wanted to try. I can't explain it, guys. Sometimes you just have to follow through with what you start out to do. Who blew that? Who blew that horn? Oh, forgot about you. Get out! Okay, there goes the boomerang. <laughs> Even when it's almost broken, you still get like two or three throws out of it. Because the durability is just that good. That's so nice. <laughs> it's like, who's gonna make the first move? One of us has to. Oh! That was... That was good. Alright, bitch. Come here. Arr! Yeah! Okay, let's see if this was worth it or not. Mmm, not so much. <laughs> well, kinda. Golden bows are nice, they get that nice zoom. And that one actually has bonus damage, so... Sure, why the hell not? Alright, where are we on the map, guys? Looks like we're heading for a ravine, and if we just keep going this direction, we will hit the edge of the world again. For like the fifth time in the fifth different place on this map. <laughs> what was that? Ah. Almost missed it. It was blended in. Sweet. It'd be really nice to find at least one more shrine in this video, guys. I think there's got to be at least one somewhere over on this portion of the map. Oh, no. Grab it. Damn it. <laughs> Every time I try and grab these rush rooms, I end up, like, missing or falling to my doom. These things are freaking treacherous, man. They're more dangerous than the enemies. 